What's up YouTube? I'm back coming at you with another video and this video is my small YouTuber tag. I am a very small YouTuber. One day I hope to be big but right now I'm pretty small. So I hope you enjoy. If you like this video please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and comment down below. And as always be true to who you are and be yourself all the time. So I'm back. If you notice I have a different shirt on this because I got hot so yeah. Um, in the fall, which is weird, but whatever. So I'm going to try to pull up these questions if life gives me a break right now, because they were up. Yeah. Okay. So these are the small YouTuber, so these are the small YouTuber tag questions and let's get started. So number one, what inspired you to start making YouTube videos? Um, the thing that inspired me is I'm a radio TV major. I went to college for that. I thought I was going to be on the radio. Didn't work out. I did do some internships. It's just really hard to get into radio. A lot of people never leave radio unless they get kicked out. And it's like a really fun job. I did a couple things. Um, with radio like I did some commercials on the radio and things like that that I didn't get paid for but it was a good experience and I feel like this platform can help me express myself I'm a pretty creative person I like to talk not a lot but a good amount and um, I thought it would be fun to just make videos and maybe I could you know do something relatable to people and we could um, chat you know comments I like when people comment I think it's a good um, outlet for me and um, I love YouTube like I'm on YouTube every day watching videos every single day so and YouTube taught me so much like it's taught me how to do my hair and makeup so I can't ever hate YouTube <laughs> and I love that you know this is like a platform to express yourself talk about issues you want to talk about um, you know um, show off your talents it's really good so I think that um, what inspired me to start making YouTube was actually when I went natural, meaning, um, my hair used to be relaxed and straight, like naturally straight, which if you look at my other videos, my hair is not straight, it's curly, and, um, when I was going through the whole transition to get my hair back to its natural state, I watch YouTube a lot, and that inspired me because I was like, these women have helped me so much, and if I can help anyone, even one person, like, <laughs> that's crazy, because I like helping people. I like to um, chat with people, you know, um, I can meet people all over and that's like a really good thing too because like YouTube gives you experiences where you can meet people from all over the country, all over the world. So I think the thing that inspired me was watching YouTube myself thinking wow these people are doing it like they're making an impact so yeah that's what inspired me. Number two, how long have you been on YouTube and have you had other channels? So, um, I've been on YouTube for four years now. Um, I have had other channels. One was just for school. It was like projects that I did, things that I filmed, videos that I edited. Because, as I said, I was a radio TV major. Um, but I've only had one other channel other than this one. Where do you see yourself? And your YouTube channel in the next five years. Hmm. The next five years. I'm hoping that I have like a million subscribers in the next five years. Um, that I can travel, meet people, meet my subscribers, give back to the community, do giveaways. Um, yeah, that would be amazing. My cousin actually has a YouTube channel and he has a million subscribers. And he's been working hard for four years and... He gets to do those things, and I wish I could do those things as well. So, yeah, that would be great if that could happen to me. And it does actually help you um, give back to the community because, of course, as you know, YouTube, if you make money off of YouTube, which I don't at this moment, um, you know, more money means um, more ability to give back to the community and donate. So, yeah, that would be great. Um, number four. What message are you trying to get across with your videos? So my message is, and actually I have it in my banner I believe, or my about me section, it's be yourself all the time. So 
And that's like my little catchphrase now, really, because I think that people in today's society always try to be like someone else. I actually had this conversation yesterday with someone about how, like, there's a woman, I don't know if, what her name is, but, like, she's famous on, like, social media right now because she, like, changed the pigment of her skin. She's a white woman and now she's black. And she changed the texture of her hair. She got her lips done, her boobs done, her butt done. Like, it's crazy to me that people are that unsatisfied with who they are that they have to just do a whole like 360 like it's crazy and um my my intent for my videos is to show who I am hopefully I'm relatable to someone and just get across any messages I feel necessary that I am passionate about um I feel like recently my channel's gone a different direction I started off doing just makeup and stuff but since I've had a lot of health issues and I can't do things as far as makeup on my eyes right now and um you know, uh, beauty things, I am focused more on doing things that um, I find interesting. So, um, you know, the direction that I want my videos to go in is that they're honest videos, they're upfront videos. I'm not going to lie to you guys about anything. Nothing I say on this channel is a lie. So, yeah, I think that it's just about life in general, being, you know, 20 something years old, trying to just make it through life. This is really what I think my um, videos, I try to put across in my videos. So, um, fifth question. Do people from school find your channel? So, I'm not in school anymore. I'm not in college anymore. But there are people from when I was in school who um, didn't necessarily find my channel. I promoted it a little bit on Facebook. So, they just know about it. But, yeah. Um, number six. What does your username mean? Okay, um, my username means, it doesn't really mean anything. The reason why I came up with it is because I used to say when I wanted to do radio that my stage name would be Angel Marie because my full name is Angel and then my middle name is Marie and it's spelled different than typical like M-A-R-I-E, it's spelled M-A-R-E-E -E. and I just thought that was catchy so Angel Marie is like my stage name. No one knows my last name on here and they won't ever know. <laughs> um, and TV just because like this is like my TV show you know so yeah that's how I came up with it I don't know how else to explain it <laughs> um, and there's more questions let's see number seven. Oh, these are like random questions okay number seven how tall are you I'm five seven and three quarters oh, I'm tall um, how many siblings do you have? I have two siblings. I didn't grow up with them, but I do have two siblings. They're my half-brothers. Um, is this your first channel? No. I just said that earlier, so no. Um, why should anyone subscribe to your channel? I think you guys should subscribe to my channel because I think that I'm pretty cool. I try to be anyway. I try to talk about issues that you guys might um, find interesting. And also, I'm here to just like um, tell my stories hopefully it connects with someone and just kind of start like communication with you guys I want to I want my subscribers to be able to think of me as like their friend kind of so yeah I hope you guys subscribe <laughs> um, what are some of your favorite youtubers I have so many Nazanin Kavari is my number one I don't know if you guys know her she does like beauty I like love her um, I'm going, I'm going to look right now to see, because, like, when you, when I'm not prepared for stuff, I need to, like, look. So, let's see. Nazneen Kavari, I love this uh, mukbang girl called uh, Sweetie Snacker. I freaking love her. Like, she has the best story times. Like, she's my newest, like, obsession. Like, I always, like, get, like, weird obsessions with people. Like, before um, Nazneen Kavari, it was um, Kashal. Um, I think that's how you say her name. I can never say her name. She's British. She's a Kershaw beauty. Like, oh, love her. Um, let's see. I watch Kavari Vlogs, which is uh, Nazanin's Kavari second channel. Um, Manny MUA. Um, su su I think it's Super B Stella. I watch her. She's like a plus size model. I watch her. Um, Thrift Thick. I love Thrift Thick. Um, the Social Life, I like her. She's hilarious. Um, oh, my newest obsession, uh, 
Naima Ta Tang, I think her name is, Naima Tang, she's like, oh, she's everything. Like she has like this deep, dark, chocolate skin, flawless skin, does great uh, reviews. Oh, I love her. Um, I have so many guys, like I don't even know, like... I used to be obsessed with um, Andrea's Choice, which I still love her, but like she doesn't really put out content like a lot, a lot, so that was one of my favorites. Um, oh my god, there's so many, I don't even know. But yeah, that's a couple, so I was like too busy looking to see who I could stalk right now, but anyway. Um, what's the best thing about YouTube? The best thing about YouTube is that you're free to do whatever you want on your channel. You could do like anything on YouTube. You could do reviews on food, you can do reviews on hair products, you can do um, talk about video games, talk about your favorite, I don't know, cars. Like YouTube is endless. You could do whatever you want and that's what I like about YouTube. Um, worst thing about YouTube is of course the trolls, the haters. Um, I have a video about haters as well. Um, it's not even like the, I mean it's obviously the worst thing but like it's just what it, it is what it is like people are gonna comment they're gonna be mean they're gonna be disrespectful that's just the worst thing about YouTube I think just the hate that you get um what are your goals when it comes to YouTube so my ultimate goal when it comes to YouTube is to hit a million subscribers that would be amazing I'm very small like I don't even have a thousand like but like my small term girl it bleh, my small term I can't talk you guys my small term goal <laughs> by the end of this year is to hit a thousand like I'm praying and hoping for that but you know even if I don't get it right away it's okay it's a process it takes time it takes consistency which I was not consistent prior to this um epiphany that I had after the issues I have in my eyes like I have like epiphany like or I gotta do at least once a week um consistency is like the biggest thing my cousin says that the one that I just talked about earlier um by the way if you want to know who that is his name is Tyrone Magnus and I will link his um channel in the description box below he's really big on YouTube so yeah and he told me consistency is one of the things that you need to uh do to be successful at YouTube um and uh oh any advice for new youtubers my advice is to be consistent from day one i think that if i had i would have had more subscribers i would have had more content out there um that's my number one advice also don't let the people that comment on your page like deter you because it's always gonna be like that life is like that you gotta get over it um people are gonna hate even when you're not on youtube so um and put out stuff that you like like don't do things because you heard that oh this gets the most likes or this gets the most views do things that you like don't do it for views don't do it for subscribers do it for yourself first I think that that's like a main thing that I would say to any person who wants to start a YouTube or is new to YouTube and um, that's probably the best advice I could give so yeah um, I think that's the last question like my phone is like so weird right now but yeah that's the last question that I have I looked everywhere for like good tags for this and like they'd say like 20 questions it'd only be like six and then I had to go to another one so yeah but yeah um please uh thumbs this video up like and comment down below subscribe if you like me if you don't sorry um yeah so thank you guys for watching and I hope you guys have a good rest of your week and as always I'm gonna say this now every time be true to who you are and be yourself all the time thanks <laughs>